Today, we're gonna be doing a packaging video. I've got nearly 30 items to get packaged and out the door this morning. I need to do it at relative speed, so I've set myself one hour to get this job done. Alexa, set a timer for one hour. One hour, starting now. Hey everyone, welcome back to Cooking the Haydens. I'm Carboot Chris. The time has already started, so I'm against the clock. Um, I've got a stack of stuff to get packaged. Um, I'm going to get straight into it. I'm going to start with the items that have got multiple items in one order. I've only got one of those, I think, so I'm going to get that one out of the way. Then I'm going to move on to the easy stuff and finish up with the harder stuff. So we'll start off with this. Um, Mike Calpin, shout out to Mike and Francis. Um, four items in one order. Really appreciate it, guys. Thank you. So we've got, I hope you don't mind me showing. Um, we've got Pop, Black Panther, Mickey Mouse mug. Um, this uh, Star Wars, it used to have bubble bath in it. I've drained it out for him. Makes life easier for posting and he didn't mind anyway. Um, and also this backpack, Mickey Mouse. So we're going to get this package. Now I'm going to need a box for this. So this would be nice to get out of the way for four items. So uh, probably a reasonable size box. start I could barely get that out okay it's not often I say that hope your sales are going well of course I always say that well, always wish wish you guys well with your sales Drop us a comment if you like packaging videos. I find them a bit like, mm, a bit boring, but the last one I did did pretty well. So if you like them, that's fine. I'll just video myself doing it. So I'm gonna wrap each of these things individually, just to keep it nice. Uh, this one's gonna take me a while. It's gonna set me back a bit time-wise. So, Give the mug a nice good wrap because that's the hmm. the most breakable item along with the pop figure. So we'll we'll wrap these individually first. If you've got any good suggestions on packaging while you're watching this, drop us a comment. Always good to hear. Good ideas, tips, all that kind of stuff. Doesn't have to be amazingly neat this, I'm just doing it so that it's got protection inside the box. The clutch didn't need protection. This one, uh, a bit difficult, not really much point in putting the bubble wrap around it. Uh, but I'll just, I'll be careful with that in a minute. So I'm going to use some paper, some void fill. I'm actually running a bit low on paper at the minute. I could do with the neighbours coming up trumps and giving me some. Void for the net. Okay, let's put the mug in. That's the most. I'm going to put that. I'm going to kind of just. Like that. I don't know if he's going to fit. Actually, I don't know if he's going to fit in this box. It's not, is it? Yeah. I need a bigger. I'm going to need a bigger box. What have I got? Mm. 
Eee, e gum. It's not a good start. Right, we use this one instead. That's just cost me precious time. Mike, Francis, I hope you're happy. You know I'm only kidding. Right, I'll save that one. There might be another opportunity to use that in a minute. Okay. Let's go again. That's a better size box. Mug first. Pop bigger. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna pack round that a bit. surrounded it at the bottom. Now I'm going to go for the Star Wars. Yeah, we should... Oof. Actually, I can take the base off. That's useful. I can't take this off. By the looks of it. No, I'm not going to risk breaking it, so... If we go like that... Still a bit... I'm not happy with it. Really not. Awkward to say the least. If I can maneuver this pop figure around a bit, that's it. I think that's got it. That's okay there. Now, if that can go, I'm still struggling with that. Come, come on, is it going to come off? Right, no. Right, I've got it. I found a way. There we go. There we go. Right, I need to pack around that. Just to protect that little tail thing. Perfect, perfect. That's bloody marvellous. Huh? So you can see where I am now. Now, I don't want the... Um, newspaper ink to rub off on uh, Mickey so just gonna just give it a little covering it doesn't it's not for protection per se because it's a plush but just to stop the any ink coming off on on Mickey that's fine squidgy it in there I just hope that is okay I don't like it don't like it. Let's go the other way. I'm trying to protect the Star Wars. Right, I think that's okay. I think that's it. Yeah, that's got it. I like that. So now we've got that. I'm protecting the Star Wars thing. And pack around it. We've got to take care over people's parcels. Treat your parcel how you would like your parcel to be treated. That's what I say. At least you know you buy from me, you get quality packages. And then you hand it to Hermes and they throw it over the fence. Right, I think that is okay. Now, I know Mike and Francis have got one of these, but whenever someone buys from me, YouTube card in the box. I think that's okay. No movement there. Always good sign. Whoa. 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 Problem lies if something breaks before I package it. This is unedited and st that's staying in. Once upon a time, I might have cut that out. These things happen. 
shit happens, deal with it. I'm in one of them kind of moods today. It's fine. Oh, it's only brass. It's alive. Okay. It's already got a, a load on. I think that's okay. I've taken a lot of time over that. Especially because it's Mike and Francis. Um, I'll just put on the mic. I think that's going to be okay. Fingers crossed. It's in the lap of the gods. Right, that's the multi or done. Alexa. How much time have we got? You have 49 minutes left Shit. on your one hour timer. 11 minutes out of an hour. Right, let's get some easy stuff done. Cycling jersey. Copper, copper triangle. We've got a motor through. We've got to do like two a minute now. It's like piecework this, isn't it? Thank you card. Goes in with every order. Actually ran out of them the other day. Has a discount code on it as well, which people can use as a repeat customer. Put those there. What do you reckon? Am I going to do it in an hour? I don't think I am. Copper triangle. Another cycling jersey. This one only listed, sold very quick. Specialised. Nice colourings on it, gold and red. Nice block colour sort of image. That kind of stuff does well with cycling jerseys. Get a few of those out. Specialised. I've got some smaller bags this time. I think the last order I ordered some smaller ones. Normally I just order boxes because um, bags I can get quite easily for nothing. But I still like to have a few of these eBay ones. So that's specialised cycling. We'll know what that is when it comes to labelling. Uh, I'm getting all the clothing done super fast here. Mastodon. Mastodon, 2017 t-shirt, like a band of some kind, I don't know, if it's, is it metal, rock, something like that, heavy metal, I don't know, it's probably on the listing when I researched it, but I've never heard of them, I'm sure they're all very good. So... I need a new marker actually, this is running out. So, Mastadon. Okay, stick with the clothing. This one's gonna need a bigger bag. Uh, Disney Zara Love, laughing out very easily. Fold it nicely. Presentation means a lot. It's not like you buy off Vinted and they just stuff it in a bag. Nice, neat. Oh, and the bag rips. The bag rips. Quality eBay bag. Should still be able to use that. Not having much luck here this morning. Bins there, but it's got stuff on it, so can't use it. I'm right, just going to put a bit of tape on that, just to make sure that nothing happens on that little bit of a thing at the side. That's fine. That is fine. Disney Zara. Okay, we're cooking on gas now. We're catching up. Get this thing, Sesame Street plush. 
That's a nice little plush. Great thing about plushes, dead, dead easy to package. Unless it's an expensive one, maybe over 20, over 30 pound, it goes in a poly bag. Don't need anything else. Put my card in. That's absolutely fine like that. Very rarely get any issues with plushes. Plush toys are actually a great thing to start with when you are, and I still do them now, but if you're looking for easy things to start on, just so that you can learn how to do postage and packing and learn eBay a bit, um, then plush toys are great for that. You can pick them up very cheap. You know, if you get the right ones, there's a bit of profit in them. Uh, oh. Yeah, plush toys. And this is a nice RAF sort of jacket. Warhawks 40th Squadron. Interesting one. I've had that a little while, but I've had a lot of offers on it. But I hung out for a fair price. I can't remember where I bought that from, to be honest with you. Can't even remember. I bet one of you probably remember because you've seen it on a video, but I can't. This is going international, so they probably paid a fair bit on GSP. Bag ripped again. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. I'll just put RAF, I'll know what that is on the front when it comes to labelling. Right, what else have we got? We've got a hoodie here. Mizu. Nice big hoodie there. 2XL, I think that is, or 3XL maybe. It's a big one. Is it going to go in my standard eBay bag? It should do. Let's just fold. It should just fit in there. Don't forget to hit the like button, guys, if you're enjoying this content. If you like these packaging videos, because I'm not sure. It's split again, these bags. Not good, eBay, not good. Might have to complain. Um, I'm not sure, you know, how much people enjoy these packaging videos. And this is a long one as well. If you, if you do enjoy it, give us a thumbs up. Because then I know whether it's worth doing again. That's the whole point of a thumbs up. And don't forget as well to subscribe if you're not subscribed. Because it's unbelievable. It's unbelievable how many of you that are watching right now, I think there's only about 30% of you watching right now, three out of 10 of you are subscribed. What's that all about? Do you not wanna see future quality content? <laughs> In which case you probably won't subscribe. If you do wanna be kept up to date, especially when we go live, it's really important to subscribe because then you'll know when we are live and we do more than one a week. Another cycling jersey here. Oh, what's this one? Let me just check because I need to know what it is. Bollocks. Performance tech, I'll have to refold it. It's a nice looking one. I'm gonna go for a lot this one, to be fair. So yeah, hit the subscribe button, guys. Yeah, everyone says that on YouTube, but it's a, you know, most commonly used phrase on YouTube, but it's it's true. If you don't want to miss out, anyway, that's enough of that. Otherwise, you'll unsubscribe. I know what you are like. Oh, special, uh, no uh, performance. Bloody pens running out. I'm having a nightmare this morning. 
I'm having an absolute mare. Performance side bear. I can barely read that. Right. Everything's falling apart. Again, move that there. Right, what's this t-shirt? I think we're doing all right time-wise here. Def Leopard, that's quite nice. Never been a Def Leopard fan. I'm not a fan of the heavy rock stuff, to be honest. I think the most heavy rock that I would listen to is Guns N' Roses. It's, it's a bit more mainstream, isn't it? I'd give you a tune right now, but my throat's not great. And you might be able to tell I'm a bit sore. I'm a bit bunged up. It's not Corona, don't worry. I've tested four times this week. Uh, what was that? Def Leppard. I'm going to use the other. I'm going to have to start using the other pen. Def Leppard. Well, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. Any more clothing? No. But I've got a pair of trainers. Um, Puma uh, AstroTurf trainers. I think Oliver Ian uh, gave me these. I think little Steve sent me these. I think. Pretty sure, actually. Came in a box of stuff. Yeah, so they've gone. Excellent. Thanks, Steve. There's a couple of other things here that little Steve sent me. Which is very kind of him. Getting rid of his death piles. Now, I always put a bit of bubble wrap around these. Just to keep them together, really. And to stop them, like, poking through the bags. Smooths out the edges a bit. So that's how I, generally, that's how I do shoes. Again, if it's an expensive pair of shoes, they'll go in a box. But I think these were about 17, 18 pounds. Kind of a, a regular price for shoes. So there you go. Nice and tight, nice and neat. And it'll go straight in a poly bag. trainers now I'll just put trainers then there's no competition let me just check that you're still recording mm -hmm. I think you are because I didn't want to get halfway through and realize that it stopped sometimes it has a habit of doing that Alexa how are we doing on time the time is 9.49 a.m. Okay, let me rephrase it. Alexa, how much time have I got left? Okay, here's Fitbit. I can't access the daily activity summary from your Fitbit profile. I give up. Try disabling and re-enabling your Fitbit skill in Shut your up. Alexa companion app to adjust your permissions choices. I've not got a freaking pit, Fitbit pit, whatever you call it. Alexa, my question was, how much time is left on the bloody timer? You have 36 minutes left on your one hour timer. Thank you. How hard was that? Um, I sold some pins, a bundle of pins. I think these went in the 50% off sale that I've got on at the moment. Um, so I'll just arrange these neatly. That's it. <clears throat> Let me give them plenty of bubble wrap. It doesn't really need a lot more than that. They're only pins. Nice little package. And I'm going to... I'm going to give it a little bit more padding with a bit of newspaper. So here's what I do, a bit like the old chippy, chippy wrap. Put it in the middle there, fold it. There we go, chips anyone? I think I've done this joke before. That's an old one. I 
think I did it last time we were doing a packaging. I'm not going to talk about it again. Uh, okay. So that is pins. Oh, pins. Right. I saved the bag of the pins because it's got a SKU number on it, number 21. That can be used again. So I just pop that there. If I get anything small that I can put a SKU number on, I'll use that. Okay, this one can go next. Rome Past and Present, a guide. It's like a tourist guide from the 80s or something, 70s or maybe. It's gone. Give it a bit of bubble wrap. <coughs> Again, I can just polybag this, it's pretty sturdy. Sturdy enough to go straight in a polybag with a bit of bubble wrap. baby bag. Uh, I might give that a couple of newspaper wraps as well. Chippy wraps. Just for sturdiness. Okay, time wise, yeah, I think we're probably halfway through with 30 minutes left. We're on target. Uh, what's this? Rome. You know, Rome wasn't built in a day. What a link. Right. What should we do next? Most of the stuff now is boxed. Uh, apart from this, I've got a little uh, Iron Man metal ornament key ring. Quite nice. I'll shove that in a bag as well, give it some bubble wrap. Put my card in there, the calling card. I've got a 50% off sale at the moment. Uh, everything under £10 is 50% off, so if it's 9 99 it's like five quid. So if you want to go and check out what I've got, and depending on when you're watching this, if you're watching it, I bet it's only on for one week, so it might have finished by now. But if you want to go and have a look at my store, see if it's still on, then go and have a look at movie-fusion.uk. There is a link in the description to my eBay store. Once you get to my eBay store, just scroll down a bit and you'll see a big special offer sign and it says 50% off or half price. And you can see everything that's half price. So there's some great offers. Loads of people have bought stuff. But I've still got over 300 items that are half price. That's a lot of items. I'm trying to reduce that low value stock a little bit. And get me, me listing numbers down a little bit. So feel free to check it out. I'll always combine postage as well. Send me a message on eBay if you're interested in more than one item. And I'll combine the postage for you so it's a bit cheaper. And you get an even bigger bargain. Uh, that's that Iron Man. We are doing pretty well. Right, we're definitely onto boxed items now. So, let's get some boxes out. This square size, the square eBay boxes, I think they're about six inches by six inches by six inches. That's probably my most used box size. 
because it's great for mugs and a lot of other stuff and hats mugs hats furbies it's just it's probably my most common box so i do make sure that i've always got a supply of these square ones so what we're going to put in there i've got some caps to go i've got three caps not all to the same person uh, i've got this fresh ego kid new era new era cap put my card inside the cap make sure they get it that can go in there and what i tend to use for caps is the printer paper that's left over from a zebra shout out to the tap peddler for that tip actually i'm a bit low on it yeah it's not that much there's normally got reams of that i must have sent a lot of caps recently I normally have loads of that stuff. I think that's enough for that one. It's only a cap, as long as it's boxed, it's not a major. So there's that one, new era. What's that one? See what else we've got. We've got two other caps, so these are all going to be boxes. Trump, Trump International Dubai, thirty pound. That sold for. That was another one from Little Steve. That one is Little Steve as well. Steve's keeping me in business. Um, Team Lotus, Trump. £30 for Trump. Um, I'm getting a little bit... Oh no, I've got some there. I'm going to put a little bit of bubble wrap protection around this one. because I haven't got any more. So if I put that round it, I can put some of this in. There's no ink on that, but. Just fills it out enough to stop it moving around. That's all you need. Team Lotus, let's do that one. Some nice sails there. Right, what else do we have that'll fit in a square box? Furby. This 
this little fella, Furby Connect. Put a bit of bubble wrap on this. It's the second one I've sold of these in, uh, in like a week. The other one didn't have a mask. we've got in here. What we do with his ears going down really. His ears are up at the moment. Let's try and get his ears down. Oh great. Should have thought of that before, shouldn't I? Bend your ears down a little bit for me, please, baby. Oh, I've gone about this the wrong way. It's a little bit better, that might be enough. I've got to start again. I'm having an absolute mare here today. Because I'm on a timer, that's what it is. See, that's, I need his ears to be down there somewhere. I'm on a timer, it's putting me under undue pressure. Oh, fucking ears. Right, that should do it. Better. Thank you, Furby. Okay. Bit of a layer at the bottom. One's plonk Furby on that. I didn't put my card in, did I? Put that in on top. Thirty. A few of those square boxes, right? I don't think I've got any more use for square boxes. <clears throat> uh, I've got a Where's Wally jigsaw to go out. Is it going to fit? It's going to be close. Be very close to that medium FedEx box. It's box porn. Come on. I think it'll go, you know. Let's let's do it and just see how it goes. It's going a bit cold, that. 
Oh, it's a little bit too big, but I still think it'll go. Put my card in there. Still think it'll go that. I just need to put some down the side to stop it moving. Just there's a little gap there. I just shove that down there. That will stop that moving around. Now then, let's see, have I got enough lip to do it? I think we have. I'm not going to peel that because that will now stick, that could possibly stick to the box. So you don't want to do that. So I'm going to leave that on and I'm just going to tape it. Perfect look. Actually fits just about. What I might do is just cut along the top there. So that I can just use a little bit of that adhesive tape. Because I don't want to use the whole thing. There we go, look. Beautiful. Beautiful. So I took off a little lip there, so I've got a little bit sticky. Not all of it, because it'll stick to the box. Now, just to be sure, because that might not be enough to stick. I mean, that's perfect. Perfect. I'm going to give it some tape as well. The other end's fine, but this end is just a little bit vulnerable. Oh, the box is vulnerable. Oh, are you all right, little vulnerable box? We're going to look after you. Get a brick. We're not going to look after you. <laughs> oh, my God. What's going on today? This is not like me. This is not like me. I'm under pressure. Shit, that's gone to crap. I'm going to get rid of this rubbish while I'm here. Right, let's start again. I'm going to look after you, little box, little vulnerable box. <sighs> I'm losing the plot. Right, there you go. That perfect fit. So it's uh, Wally. Okay. That one's been cancelled. They did sell this, but they asked to cancel the order, so that's going back in stock. This one has not been paid yet. I think they're not going to pay. Just got that inkling. So I've got this Xbox game, I think. Is it Xbox? Uh, Xbox One Halo 5 Steel Bucky thing. Um. I might use this small FedEx box. No. It's a bit overkill, that. Oh. I'll just go with a small box on this one. It's because it's a steel box and it's thicker than normal. It's not going large letter or anything like that, it's too big. So that'll fit in there. Give it some padding. Oh, that's fine, that's fine. I am going to put a bit of bubble wrap around it, just because it's a steel box. That'll help it fit in the box a bit better as well. Perfect. Give it another, another layer there. Is that enough? Yeah. Right. Okay, 
So that was Halo. Right, we're getting there, we're getting there. Slowly but surely. Right, this sold super fast. And you know what? I added a video onto the listing. Do you remember seeing it uh, on Instagram or on the live show? It's a vintage, retro, vintage bush shower radio, fully working. I did a video of it working, put it on the listing, sold within a couple of hours. Nice little sale, that. I think it was about 22 quid. It went higher. It sold higher than the average as well. That was probably, it probably helped it. So we'll give it some bubble wrap. Going in a box as well, don't worry. Now, I might get rid of the, one of these old boxes. Right. Okay, that fits. We get an ink poisoning. I keep keep your eye. Upcycle to another box, reused, save the planet and all that, to as far as we can. So, that's okay. That is the frog. Okay, done. Now we're getting down to the last dregs and dregs. I've sold one of these shoe things. One of those. That's going out the door. These have been slow sellers, these. I literally sell about one every two weeks or three weeks. They'll go eventually. I've had to drop the prices down. Still making a profit on them. Just not a lot. I won't buy them again, put it that way. I will not buy these again. I've got the perfect size box for that. Oh no, actually. Probably use this to recycle that one. Yeah, happy days. Hope it's still recording. If you're watching now, it means it's carried on recording, obviously, but it's a worry because sometimes it goes off and then I end up talking to myself for about two hours. And then I realise I actually stopped recording. And that's really annoying. Okay, so what was that? Shoe. Shoe thing. Okay, down to the last two items. This was a cracking sale. Uh, this is a this is an Easter Island uh, statue. Fifty odd quid that went for. Belting. Very very happy with that sale. Shout out to Jason T Smith. I probably would never have picked that up, but with his tiki knowledge and Polynesia and all that, I decided to pick that one up, and it paid dividends. Now then, 
what box am I going to use for this? Because it's a lot, it's a bit long. Well, I didn't put my card in, did I? Alexa, how long left on the timer, please? You have nine minutes and 40 seconds left on your one hour timer. It's going to be close. got one here but it's a bit broken I'm not sure if I can use it now let's have a look it would have been a perfect size is it too broken that's the question yeah in fact that's not really any use for anyone um. <laughs> I wonder if I can put it in a tube. Would that work? That'd be novel, wouldn't it? No. Stupid idea. <clears throat> Is it too long for that one? Yep. to go in a stupid sized box but they did pay a lot of money for it so at least they'll be happy that it's in a nice sized box this is too big this really there's always one in there like an awkward item it's not really awkward really to be honest it's pretty simple but that's way too big, that box, but I'm going to do it anyway. I'm just going to pad it out. Pad it out. Nice little layer on there. I forgot the card, so I'll shove that in and all. Shove that in there. Hopefully they'll find it. Squeeze a bit in at the top and a bit at the bottom. And then fill it up. Should probably do it. I don't think that's going to move around anywhere. Okay. It's fine. Uh, Easter. Island. It's fine. Do the shake and back and put the freshness back. Do the shake and shake back and, and put the freshness back. Do the shake and back and put the freshness back. Do the shake and back and put the freshness back. Do the shake and back and put the freshness back. Okay, sorry. Fire guard thing. Picked it up recently, sold it very quick. Now I'm hoping, yes, it unscrews, makes life a little bit easier. Whoosh, well saved. In fact, will that fit? Oh, it comes undone anyway. It's 
So we're going to pull that to pieces and we'll put it in another big box. Hopefully they can figure out how to put it back together. Right. I want to stop this clanking around, really. So. Okay. layer of paper and then I'm gonna I'm gonna wrap each item in paper don't really need bubble wrap to be honest just wrap each thing up Paper for each thing. Make sure I don't leave any out. A lot of paper. It's like Christmas this when they open this. A bit more still. About three newspapers in here. I think that might be enough. Oh I didn't put my card in. And that is the last item. Let's find that. Do the shake and vac. It's a shake and vac test, that's what we'll call it from now on. Uh what was that? Fire. Fire guard. There we go. That, we've done it. We have completed the task. Alexa, how long left on the timer? You have 20 seconds left on your one hour timer.
up. We've done it with 20 seconds left to go. That was close. That was very close. I knew it was going to be, but there you go. So somewhere about, I think there was about 27, 28 items there to go out. Now all I've got to do is get them all printed off, all the labels, and get them dropped off. And then that's this lot all out of the way. Thanks for watching, everyone. I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope it's kept you company for the last hour, you know, white noise or something in the background while you're working. Let us know in the comments if you've enjoyed this kind of stuff and uh, make any comment you like. I'll always try and reply to it as long as it's not too rude or naughty or abusive because then I'll just delete those. So there's no point in even make, making a comment if you're going to do that. Anyway, listen, we'll see you later. We're done. We'll see you on the next video or the next live show. Hit the sub and the like. See you later. Take care.